In a nutshell, it's a communications issue, not just for the communications section, but for the division as a whole. The Five on Your Side investigators breaking news today that Cleveland Police Chief Calvin Williams launched a comprehensive internal investigation of his department. This is in direct response to the News 5 domestic violence documentary, The System, a call for help that uncovered major mistakes made during our 12-month-long investigation. Tonight, in a rare event, Chief Williams sits down with Five on Your Side investigator Jonathan Walsh and gets candid about what went wrong and what they're doing about it. We want all those calls for services to be handled in a proper manner, and this wasn't. Cleveland Police Chief Calvin Williams and two commanders launching the internal investigation just days after our documentary aired. And I think we all agree that there are some things we should do better. In June 2017, Michael Hartman brutally assaulted Melissa Loomis and walked away. Five on your side investigators came across the aftermath. Who's the guy? That's her. I guess that's her friend. Her boyfriend. He's walking down her ex boyfriend. All right, we're gonna we're gonna go follow him. We're gonna go follow him. We kept calling and calling 911, telling police exactly where Hartman was, so they could arrest him. Police have not shown up yet, and this is the fifth time I'm calling now. We have an internal investigation, and then we'll find out what happened with everybody involved, uh, from the call taker to the officers on scene, and if there's accountability measures to be uh, taken, then we'll take those. The second time we tracked down Hartman was right here at his apartment. Michael. He had skipped out on court. He was making threats against Melissa, saying he was going to kill her. And it took three and a half hours for police to arrive, only for them to walk away without doing a single thing to apprehend Hartman. The second issue comes up and making the arrest after a warrant is issued, we're looking at the entire process to make sure we do a better job. How do you feel about that? Good. Good, because they did mess up. Melissa, reacting to the new internal investigation, remembering what it was like during the time when Hartman was on the loose. He said, I'm coming out there tonight to kill you. I feel like the system is failing me. Like nobody cares. What goes through your mind when, when you hear a victim saying, what about me? Well, of course, you know, our main concern is the victim, and especially in a crime of violence like this. Part of me feels like they owe me an apology. Police told us since that assault in 2017, they've implemented new technology with computer-aided dispatch. We've changed the system. Part of it is our response to uh, particular calls are coded in a certain way. So we're changing some of that, and along with that goes training. And they say they're examining the response of those answering our 911 calls. I listened to some of the call taking audio, and um, we could have handled it more professional. We've heard from domestic violence victims advocates who deal with police and victims. They tell us the kind of treatment shown during our documentary is something they see all the time. It makes me angry that we see so much of this happening in our communities. Desperate improvement is needed for victims just like Melissa Loomis. I thought he was going to kill me. I've, I've never been so scared in my life. Who are brave enough to tell their stories. It was hard, you know, to put all that personal information out there. And who just want to help others going through domestic violence. Don't just sit still. Tell whoever you can. Go to whoever you can. I'm Five on Your Side investigator Jonathan Walsh. Now, for extended interviews with Chief Williams and the commanders, you can check out our News 5 app. If you haven't seen the entire special report, it is now posted under the Investigations tab on our News 5 app, Roku, and News5Cleveland.com as well.